Hi, this is Rachel, and I just wanted to talk about a touchy topic. So I know a lot of people are going to give me a thumbs down and or um, have an opinion or just disagree, not like the video. But I'm just trying to tell you the truth, and it's the truth that is coming to me. And it is so important because, you know, when somebody tries to become spiritual, when they become awakened, you know, um, First of all, they might not even be in a position to just give up their job and, you know, go do things independent on their own. They might not be in a position to get rid of, you know, relationships that are all about ego and image. They may not be able to separate from family like that or get divorced, whatever it is, move on. So, um, I just want to say that... Numbers are man-made. They're part of language and they're man-made. Um, you know, our language might be known by other outer beings, outer space, whatever, other dimensions. Um, but it's still man-made. It is our languages. So they originate from things that were given to us on this planet. So, um... Basically, there's the type of predictions like the Mayan calendar and stuff like that, where they will give specific years, specific dates, blah, 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 whatever. Um, there's other prophecy people and stuff like that. There's types of psychics that try to predict years and who's getting voted into office and you know, what celebrities staying together, all this crazy stuff. So, the truth is, um, a lot of times there's something incorrect about it. So, maybe it doesn't happen the way they said. Maybe it doesn't happen in that year or that decade. Maybe it doesn't happen at all. So, it's so important to not try to put a label on it, especially just because somebody else started it. Where did the 144,000 come from? On top of the fact that if you think of it on a scale um, or like you can make a chart, like a pie chart, and you compare the amount of people on the planet to, because you have to include everybody, even people that are hidden in villages that have never seen a cell phone. You have to include everybody. You have to include um, infants that are just born. You have to include everybody. So you get that on a chart, whatever. And then you make, um, you know, a section for the 144,000. But the problem is, is that then you don't even have, if you have that, you won't even see the mark on the dang charts. Because the line would be so um, microscopic compared to the amount of people. So it's really arrogant and it's not even an intelligent thing to think that 144,000 um, is the correct number. Because... There are, one, there are more than 144,000 people watching these videos. And to exclude that many people on the planet, that's not a very spiritual, um, spiritually mature thing to do. Because there's probably more like millions. And one of the jobs of light workers and all that stuff, whatever you want to call it, I don't like how they title them all different like that because people are fighting to figure out what they are and aren't and it's you're here to help or you're not you know and then there might be different job or path descriptions but you know it really shouldn't be about separating who's for real and for not and not because if you're looking to be spiritual if there's something making you question stuff if you're starting to read stuff if you're having an awakening you're having spiritual connections you're having synchronicities you know then that means you're ready to go on your journey and the whole part of 144,000 um you know the chosen ones um you're supposed to recruit not in a pushy way 
but recruit as showing how you live and you know being there if they do have questions not to push it on them but you're supposed to help welcome them to where you're at you're supposed to help them so how is there only 144,000 and even so that number would not stay the same you know um it's just not spiritually intelligent to weigh your opinion on some enemy numbers. You can't even get the mark on the dang pie chart, you know. And then it's excluding the people that are in the process already because um, anything's possible, you know. Um, somebody totally evil today could start waking up and be a spiritual person in a couple years you know what i'm saying so it's not fair to put a number on it and i don't agree with it and i think there's a lot more and what really upsets me is people are like hey you know uh they can't be spiritual because they live in the city they can't be spiritual because they wear a suit they can't be spiritual because they go to church blah 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 that's not fair because you don't know that they might not like wearing a suit they might not um you know be in all that they might be breaking away from images and templates you know it's not fair to say that because it is what it looks like that's the way it is because that's not true and even so there's like a cliche that like you're supposed to only believe half of what you see anyway so that tells you that 100% um, doesn't make a lot of sense so I'm sorry if I upset people and I'm sorry if I'm upsetting people that posted videos that say that number um, I'm not attacking you personally I'm just saying like um, it's more important to be more open-minded and that's how you're gonna get people to turn towards you and turn the right, right way there's a spiritual war and it's so important to do this right and you know include everybody you know I mean if all you gotta do is accept you know in certain religions accept their God and then confess um people should be able it should be that easy for people to become spiritual too where they can just like you know have a spiritual connection themselves and then they can you know work on their shadow work or whatever instead of a confession so anyway i hope that this helps people and i hope you have a good day thank you